Hi, I'm Matt Renfrey. I help wine businesses sell more wine at higher prices. Last weekend, I visited a wine region and spent time in quite a few cellar doors. Now, cellar door staff on the whole are pretty great these days. And every cellar door that I went to, I was greeted with a friendly smile. I was welcomed into the space. Um, I was asked about where I'd been that day, uh, you know, what I was planning to, what wines I'd tasted. Um, I was also given some tips about other cellar doors that I should visit, things that I hadn't known about. Uh, I was asked about what sort of wine styles I liked and you know, what sort of food I liked. And then I was presented with three or four wines that sort of really fit that profile. And then a couple of wines that perhaps really stretched my palate. Um, it was a fantastic day, um, fantastic wine experiences. I, the customer, was the hero in this story and, and the cellar door staff, they were my wise guide. And I was happy to sign up to the mailing list and purchase some wine on the way out. So when I got home later that evening, I, I decided to check out the website just to see how the digital experience stacked up against the real one. We often talk about the website as being the virtual cellar door, but the experience of the two couldn't be more different. On the website, it was all about the winery, it was about their vineyards, about their winemaking techniques, uh, oak regime, blah, 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 you know the story. In this story, the winery was the hero and there was no room for me, the customer. I'd love to hear your thoughts, so please leave your comments below.